Welcome to Chapter 5 of this Cat Introduction series. Chatsy has been living in his own isolation room upstairs for the last four days to allow the other cats to get used to him. Today is his first time downstairs and you can see he's in explorer mode, looking and sniffing at everything. Of course, the others have spotted him straight away. Fortunately, neither are aggressive cats. Tigo has already met Chatsy a few times, but Freya didn't show any interest or curiosity in meeting him. They sniff noses as a sort of greeting, and Tigo lifts his paw. I think just because he remembers how feisty Chatsy is and doesn't want to repeat. In another situation, it could possibly be to start a fight, but not here. Chatsy continues to explore, completely unchallenged by either of the resident cats. This may be partially because they're both naturally calm cats, but equally, because of the correct introduction procedure, they've been fully aware of the new cat for the last three to four days without being threatened by his presence, so it's not a big shock that triggers any territorial or defensive responses. Often, when a cat is exploring, you'll notice a sense of nervousness with squat legs and a low tail, but not our ninja Chatsy. He ain't scared of nothing. Tigo is intrigued by his nosy cheekiness. Chatsy continues to explore the room and dares to touch one of Tigo's toys. Tigo rushes Chatsy, but Chatsy's obvious play response is triggered and he pushes back. Tigo isn't a dominant cat and backs off. He tried it on, but Chatsy wasn't swayed by his bravado. Chatsy continues to explore and reapproaches Tigo, and you can see a little tension in the air but no big deal. I'd expect some tension in this situation. Chatsy jumps down and butts Tigo. Queen Freya hisses loudly and everybody stops to look around. I think Chatsy is just reasserting that he still intends to be top cat round here. As shown in chapter four, Tigo doesn't want to be dominant although he's no pushover and won't be bullied. Hawkeye Freya continues to watch from apparent safety. Whenever she catches his eye, she blinks and avoids wide eyes to say, I'm not threatening you, I don't want to fight. Uh-oh, he's taking an interest in her now, but a fierce hiss from Freya seems to discourage him temporarily. She continues to blink to say, I don't want to escalate matters, just keep your distance. Chatsy didn't want to go to her smelly sofa anyway. I hope you're enjoying this series on cat behaviour. Subscribe to our channel below or visit us on Facebook to chat more about their adventures.